Good morning, Mallards. It is Saturday, and what am I doing? Procrastinating on uh, doing the electrical design of my van. So I am heading into Morning Sun for townwide garage sales and the Morning Sun art show. Let's go have some fun. I'm having a very successful time at garage hunting. Uh, so I found the missing socket for my socket set and a whole set of screwdrivers of different sizes. So the real reason that I came out today was not actually the townwide garage sales. I didn't realize those were happening, although they've been very uh, good to me. But I'm actually here because it is the Morning Sun Art Show today, uh, which means that I get to see a lot of gorgeous art. So the entire room is laid out. There's art all through the big room and the small room here at the community center. And there's a lot of pretty stuff to see. So let's go for a walk and I'll show you my favorite pieces. Already immediately this uh, Ann Klingsmith uh, linoleum print caught my eye. Uh, the reflection is makes it tough for you to see, but I really like the, the crow. Uh, I also really like this piece by uh, Taryn Battelle called Abyss, which I think is the center of a flower maybe? I'm actually, or a group of flower, I don't know. But I'm really into it. They also have like this, which is also like macro photography. We also love uh, some art created of uh, metal pieces. So we have, we have the Bob Buzzard. I like this guy. We have a banjo bob, not to be confused with Bob Buzzard. Look at him playing his banjo. Uh, and then there is Myrtle the Turtle. I'm a big fan of Myrtle the Turtle. Let me introduce you to Vincent Van Gogh. This, this is awesome. A little scary, but mostly awesome. And doesn't freak me out at all uh, because he doesn't look anything like a person because he's got a goat head. I think this is an impressive piece of art. Okay, so it turns out that I like Christina's art because I also like this owl head and this raven. Lovely. I really like this piece, Rotations of Our World. I was trying to decide, I think it is painted on an old saw blade. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that this is a saw blade that they've just painted these scenes on. I think that's so pretty. This piece is called New Life and I'm obsessed. Like the leather work that looks like leaves and that, uh, this is gorgeous. This is so cool. I don't know how a person does something like this. Well, this one is already sold. Go Mim. But I love it. That's pretty. And the last part is a visit to the Laura Rock Gallery. So Laura Rock was a woman who moved to Morning Sun when she was 14 and then taught. She graduated from Morning Sun High School, taught at one-room schoolhouses, and painted all sorts of beautiful acrylic paints of the local area and of places that she traveled to but a lot of it is like local around here and she died uh, in 1956 but the Morning Sun Community Center has been gathering this incredible gallery of her work uh, ever since and it's really beautiful Roller skating in my brand new skates. It's an experience. They are definitely going to need some breaking in. There's really something to be said for rental skates, you know? Skates worn by hundreds of other people, in that they've been worn by hundreds of other people and are therefore really broken in. These, not so much. I had a lot of fun at roller skating, even if it was unexpectedly fast. I just didn't think about how new bearings in new wheels on new skates would mean that I was going to go much faster than I usually do. But it was a very good day. Garage sales, 
an art show and roller skating and a little bit of working on my van and spending time with grandma. And now I'm gonna head to bed because I'm tired and I'll see you tomorrow.